It was a moment the whole world seemed to hold its breath. After a seven-month journey through space, the Perseverance rover finally broke through the Mars atmosphere, and the only thing slowing it down was a thin piece of material made in Tiverton. Touchdown confirmed. Perseverance safely on the surface of Mars. As the robot reached its destination, the team at NASA were not the only ones breathing a huge sigh of relief. Yeah, it was really, really tense. Uh, by the end of it, I was on my knees in front of the TV, hardly able to watch. It was so exciting. Heathcote Fabrics got on board with the Mars project five years ago and was tasked with creating the strongest, lightest and most heat resistant fabric known to man. Of course, everybody was feeling very tense. There was a lot of communication between the team that have been involved in the project. So a lot of people have been involved in this. And just in case you thought Devon was getting all the glory, Cornwall played an important role too. The Space Centre at Goon Hilly receiving the first ever direct signal from the surface of Mars. Perseverance will gather rock and soil samples on Mars and aim to bring them back to Earth in 2030. As for that Devonian parachute, well, it's certainly a long way from home. The parachute just stays there on, on Mars for the time being. Hopefully in the future there'll be people going there to collect it and uh, reuse it maybe. People setting foot on Mars might still be some way off, but for now the Southwest has done its bit in taking one small step onto the Red Planet. Sam Blackledge, ITV News.